system. Boom. It's pretty crazy. Super heat. Discharge temp. PSI. Amperages. Voltages. It's pulling 13.2 amps. 245 line voltage. This thing's bad, bro. I love the system. Refresh, see if anything's changed. So, that's cool, right? Again, no gauges hooked up. This is the carrier green speed. Beautiful, infinity. What's going on, guys? Good morning. Today is November 10th, right? 2022? We're going to a no heat call in White Plains, New York, Westchester County. It just says no heat. I think it's a new customer, so I don't know the equipment over there. But we have another nice day. The low, yes, what was the low this morning? Like 27? 27 degrees. Um, and the high today is gonna be like 60. So, tis the season. But anyway, um, what up? I want to say thank you for for people commenting and, and everybody who's watching. I appreciate the subs. And um, thank you so much. So let's see what this is. Okay, how many systems do you have? Two. Okay, what uh, what kind of systems? Furnaces, heat pump? Uh, they're baseboard. Heat baseboard boiler? Baseboard okay. electric. Oh, baseboard electric or? Uh, yeah, uh, floorboard or? Uh, baseboard, baseboard hot water? No, electric. These are all electric. Let me see. Okay, I'm gonna go upstairs. This is AC. There's no heat kit in here. And this is cold. This isn't what we're looking for. This goes, you see the supply, they go to that wall that I was just telling you about, that the, where they were closed. So this is not heat upstairs. This is air conditioning. Those vents here? Yeah. All these vents that are closed? Yeah. Are that air handler? Okay that I was just showing you. That's why it says no RH detected for at least for that system. So watch. So if I come, turn it off, we'll see. That. Okay, see the two units here. That's AC only. That's AC only. Okay, so they're not heat pump. Okay, we have heat. Other baseboard? Where's another baseboard? Uh, I got another one. Uh, Could you open that, please? Tell me what you feel coming out of there. Thank you. Okay. 
la vie. Okay, now we're looking for heat to come out of here. Okay, so right now we have electric fans. Which will control this. Yeah, you're gonna smell it. Jump out R and W, R H and W, and then we'll get them to jump on. The thermostat's not controlling it. May need an independent thermostat, or we might have to go through the settings on the thermostat to see. Um, but it's almost working like a heat kit that would be in an air handler because the air conditioner air handler fan is running, and you have baseboard and independent fans there. I mean, it's, let's see. Um, okay. I don't like that fan right there. Oh, yeah. Okay. Right, so that's say Phil, the Nest thermostat. Um, he said it's happened twice already. So he's going to buy a battery operated thermostat. He didn't, he was going to go return the Nest thermostat and buy one, I guess, at Home Depot. And um, do away with it this way. He stops having problems. I guess it happened a couple times already. But when I jumped out R and W, the heat kicked on immediately. So that either that back plate or the front wasn't detecting the R H. Um, that's it. Let's see if there's another call. We're gonna go to a house right now that apparently has a zoning issue, zone valve issue on a boiler. So let's see what it is when we get there. Um, I think it's an old, old boiler with two zones on it. Check it out. So he's got this open right now. Okay, and then this one here. If you, could you go to the other thermostat for me? Mm, no. I need to turn the other thermostat up to on the heat. Please. One off? It's off. Okay, kill the power. That's beautiful. Okay. Works for me. Um, give me, so we're gonna have to change the plunger because it's a different style zone valve. So we're gonna take this plunger right here, pop it on there so we could use the new zone valve. Right there, gasket. Zip tie that up. 
And I gotta do this one too. Yeah, no problem, no problem. You got air? You got air? Keep watching it until you don't see air. Jumps like that, it's air. That from what's there? Go I'm gonna go to the thermostat. You're gonna look at this arm, okay? Okay. And you're gonna see it actuate meaning it's going to call for the downstairs zone, okay? You see it? You got it? Set for 68. So these have been changed. We just purged them. He's all set. Um, had to kill the, take the guts out because the old... Honeywell uh, plungers, the tops don't match up with them. So, or to my liking anyway. So, that's all I did. She's heating though. It's hot. It's hot. Hot, hot. All right, guys, that was just a quick zone valve chain, two zone valves, and then purging the system. Um, those are some old boilers, but they're heating. This van's a mess, but uh, I actually have another call to go to, so let's see what it is. It says no heat. Hey, guys, we're going to a no heat in Westchester County, middle Westchester, it says no power at thermostat or thermostat's blank. Hopefully it's something simple. I'm on call tonight. It's only six o'clock, but we'll see what it is when we get there, right? No, no, no. So once there's two being installed after they left yesterday with one being installed was after they left today, after they left today it was working. So maybe they turned it off. Well, I, I contacted Josh. Okay. Who I think was, the, was in, in charge of doing it. Okay. Here on site. And he uh, he's the one who phoned in the service call. Let's check it out anyway. Come on in. Tomorrow. But do you have... They turned it off. <sighs> Do you have power on your thermostat? Well, I don't know if that put it to heat. Okay. Well, we don't. I don't know if it was off for a reason, though. But last night was it working? Yes. And it was heating. Okay, so let, let's see what happens now. And throughout the day, it was working as well. 
Okay, so can I have my drill? Okay, I'm going to open it up. All right, let me see. I'm going to open it up. And then just call for heat, please. Heating up right now. Um, we're watch face on the on the we're in the middle of another in, um, a second install here, so the installers must have turned the power off. But right now I have my heat pump running, so at least we have they have heat on one of the air handlers, and we're gonna go downstairs and just check the heat pump outside. So it just looked like they had shut them off? Well, it looks like somebody hit the disconnect maybe when they were pulling the... There was, they were doing all kinds yeah, of... Yeah, maybe when they were pulling the auxiliary from the yeah, boiler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. They, had, they had to throw... Uh, Jen had to put a bunch of lines up. And yeah, so that's all. And just an easy mistake. Absolutely. But your heat pump's going right now. Okay. So you'll have heat for the night. And they're coming back tomorrow, what, to finish the install? Well, yeah. Well, we'll work see. toward finishing it. Well, uh, yeah, there's a lot of stuff. There's a lot of stuff. You guys there. did a nice job, though, up there. there I mean, it, you're doing a lot of stuff up there. It's nice. Yeah, yeah. It's a, it's a small fortune. It's the but way it's, to do it, though. It is the way to go. And, and we'll feel glad when it's all done. Yeah. Uh, and, and, and hopefully nobody falls through I'm the feeling ceiling. slightly yeah. guilty for calling you guys out when it's definitely not going. It's like the woods, guys. like... Ah, here we go. Oh, these are those Bluetooth ones, too. These are the nice green speeds. I wish it wasn't so late I'd hook up to the Bluetooth on the tablet. Let's see how they're gonna... In 2022, this thing's bad. Oh, yeah. They're good. Basically, I was a, what do we call it, nuisance call? But at least they have heat now for the night. And then I get to go home, I think, if I don't get killed by an animal out here. Check this out. So here, I just Bluetooth it. It's connecting. So right now we'll be able to see amps, volts, pressures, temps. As soon as it connects. And as you see, there's no gauges, guys. System. Boom. It's pretty crazy. Super heat. Discharge temp. PSI. Amperages. Voltages. It's pulling 13.2 amps. 245 line voltage. This thing's bad, bro. I love the system. Refresh. See if anything's changed. So... That's cool, right? Again, no gauges hooked up. This is the carrier green speed. Beautiful. Infinity. All right, guys. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Have a good night. And thank you for everything. New technology.